Hello YouTube, here we have yet another unboxing. I know you're probably getting tired of these, but this one is not of the computer sort as usual. This is a little bit different this time. We'll see what these are once I open them here. Am I going to need a knife for this? I'm not even sure. There you have it, folks. Chair wheels. Why chair wheels? Well, I'll show you why chair wheels. As you can see down there, I broke a wheel on my chair because I'm such because I'm just that much of a fat ass. <laughs> that wheel just broke clean off one day, and the wheels that are on this chair aren't really designed for the floor that they're sitting on. As you can see, they're very thin wheels. The wheels that I got that I ordered here from Amazon, these are designed for hardwood floors. So what I'm going to do is take those wheels. Hopefully, they fit onto this chair. That would be quite ideal if they did. So I'm going to take them and put them on there. And the simple operation, I'll show you how this thing broke as soon as I take the little stub out. Oh, I got oil on my finger. You. So here's the actual stub that broke off. As you can see, the plastic just literally cracked apart. So luckily this part's fine. The actual caster part didn't break. It was only the uh, wheel itself. So, we'll put those new wheels in. Hopefully they fit. It looks like they will, judged on the size of this caster. We'll uh, check it out then. Here's one of the new chair wheels here. These have a bit of a rubberized plastic, so they're act they'll actually treat hardwood floors a lot more nicely than the wheels I have on there now. And the caster looks like it's about the same size, so I think we're home free. So let's put the wheel on and see if it fits. Please be the right size. Yeah, it fits. It fits all right. Nice. I got these for about 20 bucks on Amazon. So if you guys ever have a wheel on your chair break, don't buy a new don't don't waste $150 on a new chair. Just buy $20 set of wheels and stick them on there. You'll save yourself a lot of money. So I'll put the rest of the wheels on. We'll show that. And the new wheels have been installed on the chair. I wish I had better lighting in this room. Let me go turn on the light and see if that lets you see these better. Uh, a little bit better, not much. But now there's not a missing wheel, so it's not lopsided anymore. It feels a lot nicer when it goes across the hardwood floor. The, the rubber actually grips the floor a lot better than the uh, plastic does. So not only do the plastic wheels tear up your hardwood floors, but they also slide around and just don't have the best traction in the world. So these rubber wheels help a ton. I bet even these rubber wheels would do well on tile floors because some tile is, uh, I bet some tile can be scraped up pretty good. So I definitely recommend getting a pair of uh, rubberized hardwood floor wheels for a chair. I literally, I only got these because one broke, so I just put a replacement set on there. And I just thought I'd share the experience. Don't waste money on a new chair. Just buy new wheels instead. They're cheap enough that, you know, it's definitely worth it. 20 bucks. 20 bucks for just replacing wheels on a chair. And there you have it. And plus, I wanted to keep this chair. Look how comfortable this is. It's got the armrests. It's got a cushy seat and a cushy back and that headrest right there. I wanted to keep this chair, so so no matter what, for me, this was definitely worth it. <laughs> I just thought I'd show you guys something a little, I don't know, out of the ordinary. Chair repair? Why not? <laughs> Anyhow, may have bored you guys to death again, but so be it. Have a good one, everybody. Ciao.